Hello future scientists and engineers. Today we'll be walking through how to submit the video presentation for your BASEF projects. For those of you who are already familiar with a portion of the process, feel free to skip around in the video using the timestamps on the left hand side of your screen. Let's begin by reviewing the video guidelines. You'll each be submitting a link to an unlisted YouTube video giving a brief overview of your projects. A list of example topics to cover can be found on the BASEF website linked below this video. We've also uploaded a few example presentations from past scholars that are available on the BASEF YouTube channel. For junior students of grades 7 and 8, we recommend a video length between 3 and 4 minutes, while a video length between 5 and 7 minutes is recommended for our intermediate and senior students. For group projects, if you are unable to record together, you may elect to submit a video each, or choose a single student to do the presentation. Alternatively, you can edit both takes together if you're comfortable using video editing software such as iMovie or Windows Movie Maker. Now let's go over some video recording tips. We recommend finding a well-lit, open space with enough room for you and your project away from any loud background noises. If you find your shot is too dark, don't fret. A simple key light on the subject, as well as a second light on your project, can do wonders. Lamps make for great stand-in softboxes. Windows can also be a great lighting source. You can use almost anything to record your video. Cameras, cell phones, and even webcams. Stabilizing your shot on a tripod or a table will provide the smoothest video. If these options are unavailable to you, however, it may be worth asking someone with a steady hand to hold the camera for you. In the event that your audio is too quiet or too noisy, you may consider using a dedicated microphone. If you don't have access to a shotgun or lapel microphone, you can try using audio recording software on your cell phone. Just hold it up like you would a handheld microphone. However, this will require syncing and replacing the audio in your editing software of choice. Once you've recorded and are satisfied with your video, it's time to upload it to YouTube. If you're under the age of 13, please ask a parent or guardian to complete this step for you, as you will need a YouTube account. Once on the YouTube homepage, select the Upload button in the top bar. This button is also available on the mobile app. Select the appropriate video on your computer, or in the phone's gallery. We recommend using your project name as your video title. Adding your name, grade, and school in the description box can also help. Lastly, make sure your video is set to unlisted. This will allow you to share your video with a URL while keeping it hidden from everyone else on YouTube. If your video is set to private, the BASEF judges will not be able to access it. Once your video is uploaded, copy the provided URL into the form available on the website. For any more information, please check out the BASEF video blog post, as well as the online FAIR FAQ. We've also got a Discord server to connect with fellow students and ask any questions that aren't answered in the resources already provided. For more general BASEF information and news, please consider following us on your social media platform of choice. Thank you for watching, stay safe, and stay healthy.